it because this is a map that really promotes mobility. And as I mentioned that, it's Wild Oreo to really use to a push and pull situation, but we are gonna lose those extra flashes and Morkum's control is going to be missed. This is going to be spike down, but Secret, they have no problem whatsoever taking the space that they could have lost. One enemy flash remaining. come out here and that flash point is gonna be so difficult to dodge in that range. Spencer now to dubstep takes quite a bit of damage too. And now the execute is gonna come, but Izzy is sharper than any edge, than any blade. He finds two. Now Oasis, they have a little bit of a, an advantage to take care of here. Secret, they're a little scrambled through this. Viper's not gonna have the most utility, but Marky making a case for the classic dispenser. Surprise, surprise! This site is now being overrun by the boys. Uh, over secret 2v2 no real weapons advantage here the snake bites are gonna come and the utility as well the spam will it finish nope undercooked Borkum is gonna aggress what 2v2 still a lot of utility still on the board for ripper here doesn't need it whatsoever the star is alive angles and something that secret have to be aware of is that oasis hasn't even um, established any lurk uh, lurk potentials yet that showstopper is gonna flashes to try and press the issue i've got your they do have the seekers as well here Dubstep, and the way to buy this time, does deny it earlier on, looking to see if he was going to try and wait a bit longer, but Wild Oreo, he makes it on here, can he win the fight, he does eventually do it, Wild One blind, enemy remaining. and Indy's able to get the kill, Jesse Bat finding a double, can he find another, Wild Oreo will punish him down, as Oasis takes, will counter utility by Oasis, and they stop, this push on the side flawlessly. Oh, but they and I jinx it. Godraft. They hit him one, two, three, and like bowling pins, dominoes falling after the other. Out. Jeremy, he's gonna try and double dip for even more. It's a four v two, but they can't Last understand. Player Jesse back, him to get the kill, and Cobra's gonna try to splice things up. Standing. Oh, but he runs out of ammo right in front. Behind. Oh, and that might be enough. I think he has an extra star. Nope, 10, 10 seconds, seconds left. He is gonna be vulnerable. Like, every now, time planted. I see something con run. concrete, the truly ambiguous happens. Now, all the utility and all the mechanized utility, or rather tools that this Killjoy has is gonna work out. But no! As Fork of Oasis. Truly, this could be a Wombo combo if they it? set it up right, but Dubstep could find the timing. He does, and he stops Wild Oreo in his tracks, containing him. Indy has to cross back. Now this time has to be salvaged somehow. Morgan and Jesse, standing. they don't Spike allow down, any beat. leaks. Envy, you know how crazy this kid can be, but I guess four members of Secret, how is this possible? He does slip by the Astral Divide, or rather the Cosmic Divide. He does have a Flashpoint available to him. He finds the timing, though. This does slow down. Jesse, line up. He can't find the duel. Jesse supports perfectly, and he ends. The gonna be absolutely substantial. Look at this. This could be timing too. Wild Oreo, he might find Borkum. Oh. oh, why do I say that? <laughs> you cursed him. Borkum <laughs> finds the proper timing as soon as Wild Oreo popped his showstopper. So unfortunate. But if he gets a trade on the opposing Jesse Vash's uh, breach here, is they don't necessarily have a position advantage here, nor do they have the proper utility. But they finally find the lurk, delaying them as much as possible. The Cosmic Divide is gonna come out here. Ripper has been Last undiscovered, continuing his clandestine uh, operation, but nope, they get cleaned up. And Secret have no qualms of taking this as cleanly as That's just how close and back and forth this game has been. But look at this, aggression coming from Team Secret, and the blades connect! Slicing and dicing, surgical here from Dubstep. He's gonna get flash countered, but Jeremy's there to try. Again, so, so frequent. The uptime has been commendable, to say the least. Marky spots ahead, but the Cyan and Ping, I'm not very good with colors. Ripper, he's very, very good at the clutch. Not this time around, though. Maybe there could be a next time. They try to spray him down. He is kind of getting jostled just a tiny bit. The end. So, so far, they've been like one for one whenever they do play and lose a series, or uh, rather play two series in the game. As Jeremy gets a kill on the Coco. And so if that fire is going to continue and they lost a series a while ago versus action, then it should be around or a rather series that they can win back in return. But the Spencer, uh, kind of so oh dashing the burning room there. Oh, he has blast back, so he can quickly re-engage if he chooses to, but Jeremy has other plans. He guesses right, but Ripper swings left, he gets two. Dubstep finds the trade, finally. He is all alone, now being backed up by Jesse Bash. But Wild Dorio, right on cue as he returns fire off a little bit of utility, that aftershock is going to stay Borkum away. But do you know that there's a Viper? 
waiting onto the site while Oreo instead he chooses the elevation, gets hit by the golden ability. But wait a minute, what's Borkum looking at? You Envy, he will swing, and they find both defenders. Once again, this is... I think we're expecting for a Team Secret comeback to make this 6-6 six to six before we... And just a little bit of a sidetrack there. I feel like every time I say butterfly, you know, the Tayror is part of Burrow. That's a tingle! But not thumb steps. He gets shot from behind. An oasis. They explode onto the site once more. They look cleaner. They look more efficient. And this could be a little too late for Secret to stop. Spencer remaining. has been a hero, Last but not today. Standing. As oasis, they dodge that antagonist mantle. Bit of movement. But their attack, the philosophy is completely different here. They try to pinch them, but nope, Coco he survives. He's on sufficient health. Dubstep does land an important shot, but Dispenser, he will get hurt in that process. The HP, there is no real advantage here, but the bullets, they come in by in the corner by Oasis. Coming in on here. Yes, he fast. He's trapped between a rock and a hard place, but he somehow shoots his way. Oasis, Jeremy opting to go for the forward position. Opting to go and aggress here. Maybe find a pick off and equalize things in their favor. One enemy are standing. That's right, but the jiggle is there. Jeremy, he wins that uh, that little debacle with Wild Oreo. Marky, he has a heal, but unfortunately not for himself. It is a gift that he cannot possess, only leave oh, others yeah. to. He does have a flash. At 20 seconds, he might have an extra one here. I think that was enough to cover the sound. He sticks it. Nobody suspects a thing. They swing. Oh. Do they have time? Spectres is going to be very, very nasty. And Jeremy making sure that doesn't happen. But Wild Oreo on the other side showing why he's on that raise roll. Jeremy, he secretly tags that pink shell and will march forward, giving his team a numbers advantage. I need a little expensive. Ooh. Bash. Last player Great pick standing. off here, and he finds another as well. Okay, this is a round that Team Secret so desperately needed. It looks like they're going to convert it. Coco, he's been spotted. They know where he is here. Okay, oh, able to find one with a nano swarm, but the nano machines of Secret. They don't have a sky nor a sage. And Dubs are trying to spam on through. Almost finds the angle. There's going to be Borkum to find that pick off on the Coco, which is a huge kill for them to find. They do not have a single ultimate on the Oasis yeah. side for the retake, but the bunch of Team Secret players are quite low. Just coming on through like a waterfall pouring out. Of that rope, find one, but not any much more. Marky guys does get over here. finds a Kirkham and dispenser. Having a little bit of woes here in terms of, and they have the wit. The question is the execution. How is it gonna go? That stuff finds a little bit of a gap here, but instead he falls into a trap beautifully executed by Oasis. But what they don't realize is Jeremy has already found himself in the site. Coco will make sure, or rather Ripper will make sure that this is gonna go unpunished. Dispenser, he finally equalizes it for secrets. Now we have a 3v3 in our hands. The wall is still there. Dispenser needs none of that to find Marky. And now suddenly the numbers are in the favor of Secret. Everybody is leaning towards Arcade side. But Borkum, he is very, very wary of any pushers from Canteen. As he should be. Those lurks are something Oasis love to utilize. And punish Secret on if gone, if gone unchecked. That's not going to happen this time. Here comes the showstopper. He's gonna try and swing. Nobody really getting hit by that. No connection. A bit of damage, but it's not gonna be enough. Upset waiting here on the corner. Pulled oh, in to his own demise, Envy. And Team Secret looking towards those dice. In case there will be someone there. Tagged up, but Dubstep's going to lose the fight here. Great help from Ripper up top. And even with a stun coming in from Jesse Vash, a counter from Envy will set okay. them back. And having the ults, it could be a little bit of a passive threat here for Secret. That's why you see them slow down just a tiny bit. But and even a rolling thunder to just try and contain Secret. It's still at 25 seconds, so they could potentially play here. In V, he spots it out, or at least his head they're tingling! One he enemy finds remaining. a double! This could be the round for them, but Jeremy, he will be! And found out. Here comes the cosmic divide from either side. Should secure the plan for the side of Team Secret. But Oasis, they've got something to say on the retake. Indeed they do. Spencer once again, a brick wall that Secret desperately need. He will get uh, punched out of his armor here, but still he has a life to live and a clutch, or rather an effort to really uh, contribute to this round. Still dubstep, he finds Envy, but not before. That rolling thunder, Jeremy, he cleans up Coco, and suddenly Secret, they're, they're coming out from everywhere. There has been no response whatsoever. And this perfectly, otherwise he could be running by a ripper. He swings, he finds dubstep, and Wild Oreo finds the Spencer. They look and try to take an 11th round for themselves. Coco will make sure of it, but Borkum and Jesse, they chime in. And just like that, in the blink of an eye. Just like a true veteran would. 
He's young guns, he's young kids. That's certainly something to look out for, but Wild Oreo, he has to keep his eyes out because he has no idea that someone's here. He still gets a kill on a Borkum! Borkum didn't even have any idea that Wild Oreo blew past him with a blast pack. Keep your head on a swivel, otherwise you're gonna get caught off guard. Coco finds a kill on Jeremy! A huge kill for Oasis to find! For two kills away from potential! Over time, but that's oh, oh, two man. kills. Get both of them. One v two. It's all in the bag. He does have a flash. Actually, he scratched that. All he's got is the aftershock. He one has enemy now. remaining. Find the one kill. Oh, one v one rap. He knows where they are. Got out the stun, but Marky gets the kill, and we're going to overtime. Where all the members of Secret are, they are postured towards one side of the map, and Wild Oreo nearly gets a haircut, but Envy, he has that DA side double back around, initially aimed back Spike to B, planted. and now they've got the plant back in A. Look at how much of their control is focused on holding A main and playing the post plants from there, treating this like they should. Porkum gets that kill to try to play things up, but he's not going to expect Marky to be that close. Gripper will find the kill, but not after Dispenser finds one already on that trade. 3v2 here, Raph. This oh, is dicey. Not Team Secret. Oh dear! Dicey indeed, but Jeremy! Oh, he's a little too sharp for this. Rip a room. He will fall. I thought Jeremy could have missed that just a tiny bit, but somehow they recover as well as he can. But the time, it's winding down the utility. He's still looking quite healthy. He cannot power through no that way. up. But after shock, but it's Oh dear, like crumbling. Beautiful play there coming from Oasis. They get the plant, they control A main because they know that the post plant for them is and stay in the site now and hold that crossfire. Beautiful play coming from Oasis. And now they are the ones on the defense and they get the opening kill on the them as well. That's two rounds down in overtime. He's gone down, traded by Jesse Vash, but ultimately will it get them the control they need? That is truly oh. still shoulder to shoulder. I mean, they're right above each other. Borka fights the gamble that Oasis, that was their one chance for Ripper o. Is he the clutch? Is he the savior? The answer is no. And it looks like Secret, they still want this game to extend. They want this overtime to continue. Somehow, when everything seems so lost, they find a way. And that is why they won that, they held that crown here for the local scene. But they're gonna have to really prove it. Over time, they have the man advantage. Borkum taking lots of damage in that fight. Marky's a crack shot, but can he land the shot? Yes, he does on Jeremy. He's down to a 1v2, actually a 2v2. As Marky, he does not go down, almost falling down there. The One dispenser, enemy remaining. But he will eventually be equalized in V. Now, as it's all on dispenser, 1v2, but cannot oh! win it as Oasis take map. We've seen too much of in our league, and Jesse could be the potential first victim, but a little bit of a mishap there with a flash. We'll save Jesse. We'll even enable the rest of Secret to push. And Pinch, Ripper One finds the frag, but the rest are Envy, unfortunately, not enough to confirm the kill. They're all by low, so a single right Team click to end them all. He, he will be a little more fun towards that third dubstep. He Oops. is going to be spotted out crossing. Marky pushed up with that trail over. Smartly done. Oh. Used that power position Concealment. so calmly placing a star Concealment. there. He now knows that there's somewhere towards the left. How close to death he was, neither of them are really there. One he finds the kill, Mark, he's able to find one, does Wild Oreo as well, 1v2. It's Barkham time, baby! He has to Who's bring it out now, it? he's got the star. One he comes out, he wins the fight versus Goko, and Wild Oreo, very low. No. He's sticking to DQ, but he's gonna call his bluff. Here comes the swing, and he wins the fight anyways! The ROG clutch, coming from Wild Oreo. Something happened here. Ripper is gonna get tossed up here. Bust is not gonna get checked, will not get anything. Actually, we'll find dubstep skill, but dispenser, oh my goodness! This man is possessed, and he finds three without a question. Looking for his fourth and fifth. Marky, he shows himself. Remaining. Yet another teammate on the side of Oasis. He does try to reinforce. Marky is still very much alive in the situation. This time, Borkum and Jeremy, they try to hold it down. Marky has 10 HP. He wants to replicate the success of his teammates. Nope, have to wait for some of their Spike team members planted. to... Got so much to work with here. They've got, you know, the outdoor for information, but more importantly, that stun. The aftershock as well, coming from Jeremy. That's gonna be used. Envy gets a kill on Jesse back! Taken by surprise! Jeremy's gonna be able to answer back, but can he find the third? Remaining. Ripper's gonna get that kill, One and Borka brings it down to a 1v1! He gets a double kill! A triple could be his! Ripper on the swing! Not able to land the shot, as it's Borka! Spectrum Bulldog in the hand of Spencer Jeremy. Specifically, now here out in the open, Ripper was he trying to get back? Oh, he gets caught off guard. Wild Oreo finding that pick. Here comes the Hunter's Fury tagging up a bit of his teammate, but they know it's Marky to be the lone. To okay, maybe that's a little too much. You know what I mean? Maybe that's you're, you're firing me up just a little too much. 
Marky doesn't need any of that as that split moment without the Oscar smoke is going to be enough for him to find a frag. And now a 3v2, still left. very, very doable on the side of Oasis. Dispenser will make sure that this fight is going to go Last down. But it standing. already seems that Vorkum is here. And once again, finds the rotation. The cutoff, if he with 45 health, is just... A bullet away. The aggression here. They both dash out, trying to get the jail out of card. Jail, jail out of free card, basically. Okay, I, I don't really play Monopoly, but you know where I'm going with this. Dubs up. He gets the kill. Easy, easy. No friendship oh ruined goodness. as he uses that extra mobility to once again jostle and play around with Envy, but Envy needs no vision to find Dubs that finds Dispenser and that duo has been dealt with, they've been eliminated, but Envy is gonna take a little bit of damage, quite a bit actually, from both the shock start enemy and so the aftershock, but suddenly reduced to Last 2v1 Forkum, he's been unstoppable, and he's now still looking like a raid boss, but wait a minute, this is deja vu. Coco, he'll get it to half. Now is his time, but Forkum, he adjusts so, so well. Here's the jump, he hears the turret, and he picks his oh! timing perfectly, but Coco, he places the bolter. He is keeping this as stealthy as possible because the guiding light could be the death of him. Coco, who was a hero, will not need to take a little bit of the- or rather take a fight there while Morio was just right behind him. Nothing personal. Morka finds Coco. Jesse is making the bodies fall as well. And Secret, they have the sight, but do they have true control over this? Everybody's resisting. Envy, Envy finds Jesse Vash. Now Jeremy, he throws out that fault line. Marky tries to find One the timing, but remaining. he seems that he's Last found himself in a very winnable situation. Jeremy, reduced to a 1v1 situation. Oh! He has all the time in the world! Reason to check this now. But still not budging. Dispenser ta getting tagged up. And now those shock darts, they look to be the killing blow on the side of uh, Team Secret. They have the 5v4 post plant here. Good positions by them and on the flank as well on that lurk is Dispenser. You can't shut the laces down if they stall for too long. Jeremy gets that opening kill on Wild Oreo. They've got some time to work with, but not much manpower, but they all crumble down one after the other like a house of cards. Out of charge. Jesse Bass really holding on to things. He's got that recon ball to give him information. Destroyed immediately. Last but the push is coming on here. They have no idea Dispenser is here, and he's going to come in at the last possible few times. All right. Let's go. <laughs> clear. Definitely had such an urgency that the is to come. Envy, it's a nice upset on his aggression. And Marky on the swing, able to dash out back to safety. Both lockdowns to be placed, and here comes the rolling thunder out of the world. Everyone's like, they have to go. No, 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 he doesn't. Jeremy gets a kill still somehow. How does he do it? Dodging and weaving left and right, crossing him up. And here comes the lockdown as well. Wild, are you escaping it barely? Dispenser caught off guard with his knife out, and they bring it to a 3v2. Oasis have an opportunity here. Spike has been dropped in front of the B main entrance, and Jeremy will be the up. That he does. Gets a 20 kill. Oh no! Marky 30 seconds him down. Left. It's down the back. Spike it's down a 1v2. The, the eldest player here the in the server. The guy with the most experience competing. He is down in this clutch moment. Can he bring it back? He's so consistent in these situations, draft, but he's not able to completely get the kill on Marky just yet. He gets the kill now. 1v1. Oh. Coco versus Vash. But he got the kill. Coco's right around the corner. And he's gonna dump. Enemy remaining. Long. Forward with this round. So let's try to contest it. Morkum, he swings, he finds one. Will go unanswered. And Marky has been such a critical point. And what is that? He does not need any vision once more to find Wild Consume Oreo. It. And Morkum coming alive again. This is what they needed. This is what they're getting. Envy. Once again, just a brief. Menace here. Eloasis have yet to really crack down on. Lombok giving away, Borkum on the swing, lands a shot with a phantom, not an ace to be given just yet. But Coco, he can find another kill here. Ten seconds and left. he has done his job. Does get the dink. The lead is back up three rounds. Dunstep will get blinded temporarily, but does not seem to give. Swing with Jesse Vash. He's actually holding the wide angle. This Rico's gonna give him away! And he does get found by Ripper here. The Grim Ripper is making everything happen, but Borkum has got something to say. And these Aspers, man, for really stealing the show in this round number 16. Jeremy and Dispenser brought down to the 2v3. They have the potential for the retake. They don't have much utility to make it really happen, though. But if they can find a pick and equalize things up to you two, then this could be doable, Raph.
It could potentially be, but both these players have been fairly quiet. And as quiet as they can, they try to creep onto the site. Dispenser could potentially find the timing. Wild Oreo, he gets tagged up, but he stays alive. He is unbroken and he stands and shaken. Uh oh, that turret could potentially make him lock, but no! The crash of secret. Once again, it's Dispenser alone here. But Marky, does he clear his corner? Again, he is operating. We do this retake, it looks a little shaky. Off your feet! Take them off their feet, he says. Rolling Thunder come on in. Dubstep taking some damage in that, but Jesse Bastion Dubstep go find a pick for the Team Secret squad here on that retake. Great job by them to try and open up the Zone Cypher Rivers. Everyone blasts it back, and then he does the same thing as well. In the invisible, invincible on the site. But Oreo, luckily for him, able to get the Rico's online. Jeremy completely blind, but the Spencer's there to help him out, anyways. And that should be the overheat warning here as everybody is crumbling. Ripper looks to be cool, calm, and collected finding Jeremy, but all oh, for not, no, not really. Dispenser will fall, equalized. Dubstep, like I mentioned, with that operator, finds Indy. Now Ripper and Coco, One none of them are as remaining. healthy as they want to be. Borko makes sure of that, he puts... Something to, but will the timing actually work out? He spots Jesse Vash, the Jesse Vash, too quick oh. on the adjustment, and Team C will try to push down, but that is going to be the sound the prom. For secrets like hey man, we gotta retake this. Dub Step has already found one. We gotta capitalize on this as much as we can. You can see where the tracers were coming from and lands in perfectly. Not a single player on the Oasis side of the Phantom, so those tracers are gonna be visible no matter where they choose from. Here comes the counter rolling thunder. Both storms colliding the low pressure zone within this alpha site. And while Dory's on the cusp of it, Marky able to come out with a double kill and Corio finds another Coco rather. Sort of success, finding meaningful map control. The pincer is there, but oh, Jesse, looking a little worried. But why did he swing? Marky makes sure he doesn't survive that encounter. And now you should have to prompt Dubstep to move. The lockdown is going to come out again, perfectly pushing everybody away. But Envy will fall. Dubstep will make his presence known. What is that? As Jeremy, who is such a high impact player, is going to be out of contention. Now it is down to the enemy three, potentially for tournament live. But Ripper, he's looking to close this out. They knew that angle existed. You're safe there from the lockdown. That's all on the dubstep. One v three, make the magic happen. Falling up here towards Amy, dashes out to Finburn, able to get the kill. No, he doesn't. As Ripper will set them for at least this playoffs. And this is not something what uh, Team Secret fans want. Dubstep, he has the blades out. Bunch of specters of frenzy and that vandal in the hands of that. Borgum though, not able to get the kill, but they still somehow come away with it. He's trapped here in the smoke, and the specter right on time to help him out. We could be going to the final round of regulation, but Envy's got something to say about it. We've said it. He He's fully anticipating this and just so high right now. You can hear that engine, that Last king engine. Standing. And Jesse, he can't oh! find it!